I've got a stop here and you'll see I put a drywall screw in here and you might think well, why did he do that this cutoff stop or uh, bump stop was actually almost the right length it was just a hair short but if I put a screw in it cut this shorter and put a screw in there I can actually adjust this screw in and out um, I don't need this perpendicular cut for this particular setup the reason why being this is shorter it's only two inches and it is going to gauge actually off the bottom of this jig so that that is going to hold it flat that's what we're worried about that this is flat with the bottom of the, the jig so I don't need a whole lot of contact surface here now this drywall skew is plenty good I'll just shove this in here and uh, once I locate my impact driver here run this screw in and test it out now I also need to set this side to side and this is where I've got to be careful because there are four ball bearings underneath the corner of this and they like to fall out whenever I do this looks like I might have that up just a little high um, I don't know if I can reach under there or not. Maybe. Maybe I can do this. Just push it down a little bit. And then pull it out of the top. There we go. Slide this against the stop. There, now I'm bumped up.